Welcome to Jackets Required. Hello, I'm Dominic Lacquinetti, designer and tailor. In this episode of Jackets Required, I'm going to share with you how to add a spot of posh to any jacket or suit with a simple pocket square. Pocket squares are done by such icons as George Clooney, 007, and yes, even Justin Timberlake. So they're classic, yet definitely current. You could even say it's hip to be square, or at least to wear square. Interesting historical fact about the pocket square is, that as early as 500 BC, pocket squares were carried by noblemen in Greece and France, doused in perfume, so they could avoid the stench of common people and places they had to visit. These days, you should wear it for the panache of it. Dress up your suit jackets and sport coats with a variety of options. Pocket squares can be solid or even have a pattern. That's up to your taste. The trick to choosing a pocket square is to match it to some accent color in the tie. Don't try too hard to match it perfectly or it will show and people might assume you bought a set at your local department store versus having the style to create your own little combination. A gentleman never wears a matching tie and square. White can be worn with any color suit, so there's never an excuse to be without one. There are three basic styles on how to wear one. The straight fold, the corner fold, and the puff fold. The straight fold leaves a rectangle of material peeking out of the corner of the pocket. One corner fold will leave a tip of a small triangle of color sticking out of your pocket, and the puff fold is probably the most simplest and most dramatic to do, and it displays a small puff of a square coming out of your pocket. Ultimately, it is up to you on which style you prefer, what color, pattern, or fabric. You choose, but it's definitely an accessory worth having and using. Be sure to subscribe to Jackets Required YouTube channel and Facebook page to be notified when new episodes are available and to see behind the scenes pictures and clips. Share with your stylish and style challenge friends and be sure to let me know if you have any specific questions or topic you'd like to see in this series. Thanks for watching. See you next week. And remember, looking good is between you and your tailor. Ciao.